important to everyone because some of us may not have learned the skills that we need to be fully independent adults. And I'm credible because I was in high school and I didn't have these courses, so nobody taught me how to be a mom, nobody taught me how to be a homemaker. And that would have been really useful to me. So my problem is the elimination of all my courses. Uh, the causes, gender orientation, and budget cuts. Dictionary. The definition of home economics is the theory and practice of homemaking. To me, that definition seems like it would be more geared towards uh, women in the mid 19th century. But home ec courses actually didn't become in effect until the 20th century. And then Shane Shiflett of the Huffington Post states that in in the 1970s, only six U.S. men identified themselves as stay-at-home dads, and in 2014, nearly 1.9 million dads remained at home with the kids, and that accounts for 16% of the stay-at-home parent population. Home ec is often pictured as women trying to keep, learning to keep house, but that is obviously starting to change. According to Rose of Smithsonian Magazine, along the way, home ec attained the reputation of being a relic gender stereotype force meant to confine women to domestic roles. I'm not a feminist by any means. Um, but I have to disagree with that statement because of my last source, where which shows an increase in stay-at-home dads and an increase in moms working. Not to mention the increase in the transgender the gay marriages and single dads. Someone has to cook and clean. And my second cause is budget cuts. Ruth Graham, a Globe correspondent for the Boston Globe, stated school budgets are con contracting. Many more students are preparing for college and class hours are increasingly devoted to a nar narrow core of academic subjects and testing. Students are forced to learn core curriculum that may or may not be relevant to their lives after high school. My solutions for the gender orientation make it a required course for everyone to take as a senior in high school, and they have to pass it in order to get their diploma. As for the budget cuts, combine all of the cooking, health, and personal finance classes into one one-year-long required course, like I said, for all the seniors to take. And this is an example of a high school that has implemented this. They have the three levels of the fashion design courses. And then they have a life management course, which says, get your life together. Seize the opportunity to learn real life lessons related to family and friends and face the future with confidence and security. Be prepared for living in the 21st century and learning about earning a living. 